So it's been actually nearly two months since my last case study update, which is because I've been away, I took time off and I haven't been doing anything on the site really, um, myself personally, so I didn't really have much to say. But I am excited to come back and update you again because things are definitely going how I hoped. So I talked last update about writing a few articles about Europe, but I only have one up and I think there'll only be one more. Um, I just struggled with time and, and you know, it's not really necessary. Um, so I did write this one on white Christmas in Switzerland and you'll notice uh, the other change I have made myself Which is I've added ads, you know, I'm getting a little bit more traffic now So I thought I'd see what would happen um, and I've made about uh, like It's been two days and I've made about 50 cents um, But one of the ads wasn't working properly the top one too. So this one here. So usually the best converting so uh, It's still very low of course and part of me like hates to put ads when the amounts are that low because I think it's a bit of a turn off and if you're not really benefiting, why bother? Um, but then I am starting to get more traffic. I am getting traffic to my buying guides too, more so than articles like this, which generally have ads that are worth a lot more money because of the same reason why you write about those keywords in the first place, right? They go really well with affiliate marketing. So things like I've got best ice cream maker. Um, so that will get better traffic on there and then usually the ads are worth more money. So I am interested to see um, what type of return I can get because I think even with my low traffic numbers at the moment, I could get enough to be worthwhile once I work out how to optimize it. So this is the site. I mean, it really looks much the same except the ads. I've got one there, one there, one I wrote on Switzerland and there's another ad down the bottom. It's just Google AdSense, nice and easy. Um, I already have an AdSense account I use on another site, so extra easy. And there's another ad. Um, so that's what I've added, plus um, let's see, ice cream maker. I did pay someone to write some buying guides for me and my assistant's been writing them as well. So my assistant writes the keyword plans and writes some himself and some we outsource. Now the outsource ones have not really been that great, so we're gonna try a new writer. Um, but at least we're pushing forward, you know, I definitely would look at improving them at some point, but they should be good enough to try and start ranking. Um, so they're all from keywords that I thought will work in the AU market. Um, and yeah, yeah, they're definitely starting to work. So when I look at my rank tracking, um, I'm starting to rank like say 30 odd for some of them for say something like best ice cream maker for that main keyword. Um, but what's even better is say best ice cream maker 2018, some of those keywords with these products, which are still really good buying keywords. Um, I'm ranking actually even in the top five. So that's really good and it is getting me some traffic. Um, what is annoying is because I'm monetizing with Amazon Affiliate Australia, uh, well, I plan to be, is that that doesn't actually exist yet. So, you know, and there's no good affiliates here really in Australia. So I haven't been able to put affiliate links. It just links to amazon.com or .au if the product's already on there because .au still has limited products up. Um, it's more and more all the time and a lot of the products are on there and I just link to them directly without an affiliate link. Uh, but uh, yeah, but it's still not as many as I hope will be there in a few months and hopefully they'll get their associate program up too. Uh, so to give you a look at my traffic, it's definitely improved. So this is sort of the whole lifetime of the site so far. So you can see up here, it's great. I got a little boost here just simply because I finished that White Christmas in Switzerland article and I shared it on my personal Facebook profile because there was a lot of people interested in that. As Australians, it's a bit of a thing. Um, oh, sorry, that's not there. That's when I moved the website. Um, that's that peak. So I talked about that last time in the video. I reckon that was just mostly me checking lots of things. Um, sorry, this is a little minor pink peak. That's because of that Switzerland article. Um, and then this is all, it's all Google search. So, you know, that's heading in the right direction. You know, 244 sessions last uh, week. I'm super happy with for a site I'm putting no effort into and I um, have only had for a few months. So that's great. I've done some more links, but really not much myself because I have been busy. So it was more like some collabs that I put in for, you know, they got published. So there's a few more links. And um, someone owed me a link I collected on yesterday. A few other people I'm trying to collect on. Um, but people can be really unreliable with this stuff, unfortunately. But yeah, that's how it's going now. Everything's in the right direction, you know, slow and steady. Um, and my plans for going forward really is just to keep doing what I'm doing. I get a few more articles written and up and really just plot along and just, you know, wait for time to pass to help with all of this.